All right. Uh, I got a uh, big box. Um, this is the... Hold on. I'm just going to hold it off to the side here because it's big. This is the Hot Topic. This is the... The Hot Topic order I did January 21st. The slew of orders I did January 21st. Uh, this is the final uh, package from that order from Hot Topic. Uh, I got another order from a different company. Uh, the Funko Shop order. It also came in, but I'm going to do that separate. So we're going to do one video with this, and then the other one will be in another one. Um... Cause I gotta talk about box lunch just for a sec, but uh, I could probably do that now and then it'd be like, you know what, just skip to a certain point if you don't want to hear about the box lunch thing. But uh, this is the Hot Topic order, the final one. It was the first one to ship. It shipped January 22nd. It shipped the next day, but it was the last one of the three that I ordered. The previous one to come in would have been the Eddie Van Halen. And then before that was Lucky. Lucky was the first one to come in. Um, it was the second second one to ship, the first one to come in. The Eddie Van Halen was the third one to ship, but the second one to come in. And this was the first one to ship, but the third one to come in. But it's a big box. So that's understandable. So I ordered it January 21st. It shipped January 22nd. It arrived January 31st. So that is basically 10 days from order. Nine days shipping. Acceptable. Just so we know. And it was shipped UPS. All of them were shipped UPS. Um, the box lunch order, I want to mention that because box lunch and Hot Topic are, I think they're owned by the same company. Uh, they're the last order that I'm waiting on other than the Books A Million pre-orders. Because the Books A Million order had a pre-order of two pops. So, other than those pre-orders, everything that was in stock, I've got in. I'm just waiting on box lunch. And the issue with the box lunch is it wasn't shipped UPS. I think previously box lunch shipped UPS, just like Hot Topic. It shipped with new logistics the fun company that entertainment earth did too that drove me nuts so that i don't want to order much from them if i don't have to so when the order was shipped oh i left my notes in my room the order was shipped january 24th and it said that the estimated arrival was February 2nd. I checked it today. And first off, it said it shipped the 24th. But it was in California, which is where it shipped from. For three days before it left California. And took four days to get to Texas. So that's the last scan was Texas today, the 31st. Actually, today is, the, is February 2nd, but uh, Texas on the 31st. And now it says, uh, now it's going to arrive February 5th, which is a Saturday. I haven't changed my calendar, but I think it's Saturday. Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, Saturday. Let's see if I get it in. But it's definitely going to be past 10 days from when I ordered it. From my sh when it shipped. So, that that's all I want to say on that. I'm going to go ahead and do this Hot Topic order. Uh, it's just, if it ends up being another one that takes longer and it delays again, I'm probably not going to order from Box Lunch again. So, I'm going to go ahead and open this. Big box. But it should be a quick order because it's just, it's just one item. I think it's a box bigger than it needs to be, but... I get a big box. Oh, God. Uh, 
I'm gonna take this out. I don't think there's is there a packing slip. This is how it. Oh, oh, this is how it's in there. There's nothing. It's it's in a sorter box, which is good. I can't. Uh, get the flap. Get the flap. There. <laughs> It's about to pop. So yeah, if you you can put it in a sorter box, but if you don't put something else in it, it's gonna pop open. Okay. Nice sorter box. There we at. And it should be me, Pop Rides, Trevor. So this is the Ghostbusters Afterlife. So this is the last of the Ghostbusters Afterlife that I plan to get. When I did a video, I said that I'm just not going to get Muncher and that's the only one. It's the only one in terms of what's on the box. The, when they have um, on the back of the box where they show the... Uh, on the back of the box when they show what that set comes with, which if I can get this up here, we'll prop it on here, there we go, as you can see, the set, but here is the pop, and I think I need to take it out, this is only the third pop ride that I got, um, I don't really like getting these, I regret not getting oh I regret not getting the Winston because in the original Ghostbusters Winston was in the Ecto one. Uh, so obviously they put Trevor in it, which I think is smart because Oh, it even has the gunner seat out. Because he was the one that ended up Is it a spoiler? He's the one that ended up finding it and worked on it and, and Kind of brought it back to life. He at least worked on it. Might have a little help. A little help. It's something that if you're not paying attention to watching, you'll probably miss it. But if you if you if you watched it, you saw it. Um, I want to look at this. But I said, um, yeah, of these, because I'm not gonna get Muncher. I, I said I'm not gonna get Muncher. I, I I feel like that was just them. They didn't want to bring back Slimer. Which I think was smart because it would be like, how do you get Slimer there? Because if it's a ghost, he's he's in New York. He's a New York ghost. He's not an Oklahoma ghost. Muncher can be an Oklahoma ghost. Um, this should come off easily. Come out easily. Oh, no. I got to find the path of least resistance. Oh, where's the... Oh, I threw the box down here. Packing slip. For your information, because I did have a promo code, uh, I only paid a total of $25.54, and Hot Topic... Hot, hot Topic itemizes their lists. Uh, so you can see the price was $23.92 plus $1.62 tax. Comes to twenty five fifty four, so that doesn't include what shipping I paid. That's fine. <laughs> shipping usually runs around the six dollar range for the most part. I think on average, I can get one side out, but I don't want to put too much pressure on this side. There we go. Okay, magic of editing and cut. We got it open. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is so big and bulky. <sighs> My God, I had to take this out. I had to take it out. I had to see this. Look at that. I mean, look. 
They even have it look all the rustiness because it's the original Ecto-1. Then there's the gunner seat. God. They even have them in. Oh my! They even took. They even even though you don't really see it, they even took care to be like, hey, look, he's even wearing the Ghostbusters jumpsuit. That they magically were able to fit into. Made in Vietnam. Copy Funko 2020. That's how long these were made. They, remember, the movie was originally supposed to come out in 2020. So I wonder, were these just sitting somewhere? In Vietnam, just waiting? I never really looked at those. Like, the bottom of this. Yeah. If I'm reading this right, DRM 2004-02. So they made these April 2nd, 2020. I should check the other ones. Doesn't that sound amazing, Daddy? It's not very heavy. It doesn't feel very vinyl, neither. It's like a lot more... Like, this is the pop, and then this is just the thing it's in. I wonder... Like, I don't have a light. I'm curious what it looks like. I'm super curious. I'm gonna keep it out for a little bit, probably, and I can take some better close-up pictures, because I think I do want to have them flash on the screen. Um... check something real quick. Uh, yeah, I checked the, I checked the Mr. Gruberson uh, real quick, and it also has a date that suggests that it was manufactured April 2nd, 2020. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to leave this. I need to put this someplace safe. Uh, but that'll be it for this video. Like I said, the box launch order I'm going to do the Funko order. That's going to be a different video, but I'm going to get that one done. And um, as far as when the box launch order comes in, which has three Eternals and one The Office. And it's four... Three total are uh, regular size Funko Pop and one keychain. Because I get keychain. Right <laughs> I'm going to say that now because I don't know when I'm, uh, I'm hoping I get it. Maybe I'll get it. We'll see. But this is the Hot Topic order. This came in. It was one of the first ones to ship, actually. The Funko, the Funko Shop order was also one of the first ones to ship. It also shipped January 22nd. Let me just put this down here. Here's the case. I still got it. It's still great. It's still good. And, it, and I have a little crease when I was trying to open it, but it's very slight. I'll get it back in the box. It's got this back. Oh, what does this backdrop look like? Look at this backdrop. I'll try to remember to take a picture of this too while I have it out. Got a little dented from the product. Probably doesn't show up very well. But it's got like all these little Ghostbusters things. It even has Slimer on it. Oh, that was the other thing. I didn't finish my thought. Earlier I was saying how I wasn't going to get Muncher and I was like, I was going by what was on the thing. I did put a note on the video that 
There's also various different mini puffs, like the little mini stay puffs. Uh, I haven't gotten one of those either. I was thinking of getting the Baskin Robbins, but the problem is, is you have to go into a Baskin Robbins store and get one. And I'm like, uh, I'm not going to walk into the only two that are within a 30 minute radius and hope that they have one because they probably don't. So I was just like, I don't know. I, I just, I didn't feel like getting one. I, I figure with the mini puffs, I don't know. I, I just, I just won't get them. It, it's one of those things where they have just various different, very, don't close this because otherwise I won't be able to open it. They have different variations and I, I kind of get annoyed by things like that because I don't want all of them. That's a lot. I don't know how many there are, but what I'll do is I'll remember to look up how many different ones are there are. Uh, I'll put commons, which are commons are ones that you can pretty much go into any store that sells Funko Pops and they might have one. And then the exclusives, different various stores. Uh, like I said, Baskin Robbins had an exclusive. I think Walmart might have. Some other store I think had an exclusive. I think FYE had one too. Or No, FYE had an exclusive muncher. But, um, yeah, I'll, I'll try to remember to put how many there are. I don't want them all. Uh, I, I would prefer... I, I have Stay Puff Marshmallow Man as a keychain, pop keychain. It glows in the dark. Um, so I got, I got my puffed. I got a puffed. Okay, so that'll be it. Night.